Rebound for Zaria Wiggins. Kicks it back out in a second chance here for Auburn. Koulibaly with the finish and the foul. Aisha Koulibaly will go to the line. But I think there are other players that will have to hit those shots. Auburn's going to have to make some shots from the outside to pull Alabama out of the zone. Good strong take, though, on the attack by Koulibaly. Bama in scoring, rather. Hughes has knocked down a couple of threes. Koulibaly goes to the basket. Hughes with the dish. Koulibaly got that. You get energy from players like that. But they want energy from her while she's scoring, and I think that's a big thing. Good find by Jordan to get Koulibaly. Boy, that's a quick pace. A little too early a shot that time. Koulibaly hustling for the offensive rebound, puts it up and in. I really like Koulibaly. I didn't know a lot about her till earlier this year. Uh, an upset in a conference final, um, you know, in, in some of these one-bid, you know, uh, conferences. So you can't, can't rely on that. I think you've got to go get a win. They'll have a good resume coming in with the motion that they had early in the game. Pick and roll, didn't have it, swing the ball, get something on the other side. Can't be a stand and watch team. Yeah, that's a nice sequence. Koulibaly giving it up to her as number 23, Scott Grayson. Half time with a 21 point lead. Yeah, I mean, uh, Auburn for their program to get better, and Johnny has said it, they need to get more shooters. Uh, you just need people who are, you know, there's, uh, the, and, and the difference is there are a wonderful performance and what a two times SEC player of the year, the second leading scorer all time here at Kentucky. A tremendous, tremendous career and she will be a tremendous won't go there for Collins and the Rebels head the other way Koulibaly up and off the glass Auburn's first bucket Jackson has it in the corner finds Koulibaly at the top of the key shot clock winding down as Koulibaly gets one to go still nipped for the previous 51 games Georgia going the route of Mickelson in the lineup. A little more production there. A little more size as well. Bill on the drive with the left hand. Competitive. So the SEC could potentially get eight, maybe nine teams into uh, into the NCAA tournament. And Charlie Cream's projection right now is for nine SEC teams in the field of 60. Significant foul trouble. Precious Johnson back in. We'll see if Georgia just immediately starts pounding the post to Jenna Stadium. For that, though, Koulibaly lets it fly and knocks it. Man-to-man -man defense, good extra pass. Other players have got to step up and score the basketball. Wells had a good look there. Turned down the three. Koulibaly, offensive rebound. She was able to dig it out and get the... Strong drive there by Koulibaly, makes it a four-point game. And so here we are once again. Auburn with five minutes to go. It's the rebound of the game. None bigger for Jenna Stady than that one. Now tries to dump it on a high-low. And Auburn gets a defensive stop. Koulibaly into the front court. Just relentless on the offensive glass. Leading the nation in rebounding margin, a plus 17. Here is Koulibaly with an early look and an early two. No signs of nerves from the start for the sophomore. Any Hughes. The help side of South Carolina has been so good to where Auburn couldn't turn the corner, but if you can't get in the paint, spot it for the or like Zaya Cook. Well, earlier after she made her second three, I almost made the comment, look out, because once she gets going, we've known just how hot she can get, and finally Koulibaly gets in on the scoring defense and then look to execute an offense. Amir here has it knocked away. Here comes Koulibaly in transition. 4-2. I think you said a key word, the depth. Auburn, that win over Tennessee, their only win in SEC play. They're 7-5 and five at home on the season as Koulibaly. She's coming off a game where she scored six points and had three assists at Arkansas as they go inside. Good move by Koulibaly. And then she hit the big three to stop the scoring drought. And the bank shot goes in. The foul committed. Koulibaly will get... Weish picks up the foul. 
for the Gators. Tip inside. Nice inbounds play for Auburn as they... And Moore checking out for Florida. Into the paint. Bouncing around and in. And there's Koulibaly's impact immediately. Florida. The 12-point lead. Koulibaly scores that. Taken away by Koulibaly. And that one, she will get to drop it a chance for three. And, and you like her score mentality. She hasn't backed away. Bind into her system. They're seeing it coming together. It just hasn't all connected at one time. And I think it is tonight. Well, Koulibaly has been quiet, but that's her first field goal here in the second half. Arkansas. Tonight, four in the hit. shot clock. Oh. Got another weapon. Mm. Well, she was able to catch, yep. lean back, and score. For Koulibaly. That's a good basketball. Taken away by Koulibaly, and she scores. And that's exactly what Coach Harris says. you got to stay with it. you got to stay in the moment. Don't give up on the play, and Aisha Koulibaly did not. We've got uh, Wills out in front here trying to set up a screen and roll for for Jordan and then for Koulibaly coming from low post. Incredible cut to the rim there from Koulibaly to tie the game up. The pressure on her because of the defensive pressure that Auburn will apply. Tonight Wells went one for two from the strike. Auburn gets the offensive rebound. They find Aisha Koulibaly. Right now getting under control, running their half court offense. Koulibaly's the engine that starts this team. Make it a 9-0 run as Koulibaly hits from the top of the key and Doug Novak. Bounce pass down to Jordan who knocks it down. Some nice basketball there. Jayla Jordan for Auburn and it was Jerkayla Jordan for Mississippi State but that's Aisha Koulibaly. That patience with the ball offensively just lulls you to sleep then shoots it over you. Koulibaly drives to the rim plus the foul the bucket goes in of this Mississippi State team. Let's get the second half underway as Auburn finds Aisha Koulibaly on the first possession and Koulibaly lays it in to give Auburn the lead right out of the gates. Annie Hughes now for the Tigers, defended by Thompson. Koulibaly starting the drive, good spin move and finish there for Aisha Koulibaly. What Cole has to learn is that Bostic Looking to go coast to coast, finds Koulibaly underneath the hoop and the harm, and one for Aisha Koulibaly. Koulibaly straight for Mississippi State. Bulldogs lead by 12. As the Auburn finds Koulibaly underneath, gets the bucket plus the foul. Pull up jump shots, and that is exactly what Auburn had been missing. I have three Vanderbilt players in double digits in just the first half. Moore, Cambridge, and Alexander as Moore's got 11. There's Kudabali. The tonnage of basketball knowledge in this gym today is pretty impressive. And that's the leadership right there. She was well aware of the shot clock. She's just a very smart player. South Carolina very likely the odds on favorite at the national championship this year, but NC State's very good in the ACC. There's a floater that goes down low. Good body. And that's what they again were missing in the first quarter and parts of the second quarter as well. Re Final 15 seconds here. It's right now trying to take away those bonus points. A jumper from the left side by Scott Grayson won't go. Offensive rebound by Auburn and the bucket by Koulibaly. Those hustle points trying to put themselves in a position to get into the paint. A three ball from straight away, rattles in, off the window, that one knocked down by Koulibaly. That's her success, and I, I didn't realize she was coaching 18 years, but 
What a great job Kelly has done in every program she's been at. She's back home in her alma mater, and uh, nothing but uh, overkey. Tipped around. Hughes saves it for Auburn. Kulabali for three. Bang! Second effort, second chance points. Kulabali rips off the rebound after the miss from Burrell. And at the other end, it is Kulabali driving with four. Auburn showing some patience offensively. Seven on the shot clock. Kulabali spins and scores. A strong move by Kulabali. But it all started with a great consecutive points. Horston has eight points in the quarter. What a pass down low. Bucket foul. I think it might be against Tamari Key. Kulabali got her hands on that pass underneath. Knocked to a teammate. Look at Bostic go to Kulabali. Lays it in. Bostic has been a catalyst here. This Hughes thought about the three. Shot clock at 12. Kulabali releases and scores. That's a deuce. That's a deuce. But a big out three ball right side. Came up a little bit short. Kulabali, offensive rebound, steps inside, scores! Kulabali continues to be magnificent for the Auburn Tigers. It's Scott Grayson from the angle, a little short. Rebound seized on the offensive glass and a quick two for Aisha Kulabali. She's been doing that all year. She certainly has. She's just that the dominant. Around the horn. Hughes feeds it inside. The extra pass to the wing. Three. Got it. There's some rhythm for Auburn. Aisha Kulabali. And cool. That was a fun. A tired legs by this Kentucky team. Two shots at close range. They couldn't make. But they just look worn, worn down right now. And Kulabali cuts it to one. We have not been tied. If anybody you want to guard, it, it's Howard. And now time of factor. Kulabali off the glass, back to six. Got to get some stops here for Auburn. Great take by Kulabali to take it up. And Johnny said she was pretty surprised. Precious was interested in coming back because she was hard on her. But Johnny also said, look, it was tough love. She needed the coaching, but she also needed that hug, that lesson. Really with a fresh outlook of how she's approaching her game. Kulabali, short corner, pretty shot. Is in the game for the Tigers. And Alabama did not see Precious Johnson. She didn't play in the first meeting. That's a new wrinkle. Kulabali. What a pass by Scott Grayson over to Kulabali. Just smooth. Auburn to have to take perimeter shots. Yeah, Auburn only shoots 26% from three. Kula Bali. 51, that's Precious Johnson. And number five, Aisha Kula Bali, right there. That's Steps a post -game all the way that, through. That's a post game that can finish. Well, and Christy Curry, just when we talked to her, she was still positive. She said, we're focused. She said, you flush it. At midnight, after that Arkansas game, you flush it. That's gone. You work on getting better the next. You're giving up offensive rebounds like that. I know it's tough with a long rebound after a long shot, but you have to find someone. Cool. Abali knocking down the three, and Auburn retakes the lead. Just the seventh made three of the Florida. And Scott Grayson, no, but... Kulabali there. She has scored the last five points for the Tigers. Yeah, giving up another offensive rebound. And this was a problem at South Carolina as well. 26 offensive rebounds. Like she has a hot hand. That was a good look. Kulabali splits the double team, ends the drought for the Tigers. Well, Johnny Harris needing to put Kulabali in, even though she has Starkey. So these two teams know each other pretty well without even knowing personnel. Kulabali with the left hand, count it, and the foul. She scored the last four for Auburn. Kulabali. Of their first conference win of the season. It's unbelievable uh, to think that they are have started the season 0-4. Again, the tough schedule, but the Aggies early in the year were ranked. You always got to know when your number's called, you got to step up. And it wasn't just Zippy Broughton. She had a lot of points, but I thought Christina Moore off the bench made some big plays for Florida to steal that victory. We're getting on the burst the rotation of Tunders player, which allowed her that easy look. 
knocking it down. Great look for Koulibaly as she's able to knock down the triple. She's a physical player, but I was really impressed with the body control there to avoid going into the defender and maybe getting called for an offensive foul. Jordan Merritt on the make the left hand, and we saw her game. And Koulibaly inside the paint, gets her own rebound, the second chance, put back, and it's good. Now putting in the work, doing what is necessary, coming in when nobody else is in the gym to try to better herself. On the inbound, that's Koulibaly who is able to get to the volley here tonight, who has done a lot of the heavy lifting. Here's Andy Hughes, who Coach Johnny Harris says, I want her to look for her shot a lot too, but Koulibaly is there. Touched the floor for the Gators, blocked by Koulibaly. And back the other way, she has one thing in mind, and that's to get to the basket. She does so sick. Back, and that's the most dangerous thing when you let a team stay around that has the caliber plays like, honestly, Scott Grayson and Koulibaly. On the make, Koulibaly. Not the way that Johnny Harris drew it up off the miss from Rimdahl, and still a chance for the Tigers to tie this ball game as Scott Grayson drops it off to Koulibaly. You don't become a Hall of Famer without knowing what to do. She knows she has a height advantage. She wants to get the ball down low. She wants to attack the lack of depth of Auburn. Koulibaly with a pretty strong finish. Koulibaly facing a good defensive player, Newby, so active, but you can see how Koulibaly fought hard to get to the basket, get her second field goal. And that was a set play call. Runs in. Count the basket, and the foul's going to be on Newby as Wells took the contact in the paint. Koulibaly sets and fires, can't hit, but was left alone to follow up. Couldn't get it the first time, got it the second time, and the foul. Certainly not honesty. There's a steal by Koulibaly. The run out, coast to coast, and the finish. Aisha Koulibaly, and it gives Missouri a second chance. Dembella swatted by Koulibaly. And now she goes one-on-one -on -one with Blackwell straight to the hoop. You're not going to see many better plays than that. Defense to offense, down low. Kicked out, corner three. No good from Scott Grayson. Offensive rebound, Koulibaly, and just winds her way through for the layup. She's got more one-two. Has the ball back in her hands. She's a St. Louis native, back in her home state. Three. Good. Knocked down by Aisha Koulibaly. I'll tell you what, man. She... And she gets crossed up and turns it over. Koulibaly running ahead of the pack. Euro step into the paint and the finish. She's like the female version of... Uh, you come up happened. with the Lakers. <laughs> that happened. All right. I'm having trouble with names today. That was a great look at Koulibaly, the finish, Another and she's set. starting to get going here as we start the fourth. Yeah, great look. She's getting great looks. You great, great, get great looks, you tend to make them. Season high 22 for Williams. Koulibaly with a huge basket, and it's back to a one-point game with a minute to play. For students, you got the graduate students. You got players that have been able to come back for their fifth year. Their senior year again. Kula Bali finally able to find the bottom of the basket, and that was a great possession. Sleep. Auburn with the, the 12 turnovers in that first half. Alabama scored 10 points off the turnovers, and right away they get Kula Bali involved. That's also something that was. I think you're Auburn. You're trying to figure out a way to get the ball to Kula Bali and spot that she can score. And, Right there, is. you see it taking it straight to the basket. Koulibaly showing a little bit more play. Got Grayson trying to make a play, and Koulibaly down low, and it's oh, in! she got it! What a play! That ball just thrown up for her to... Before Christmas. December 20th was their last win. There's Koulibaly! And Koulibaly... And he hews air ball. Koulibaly catches it backside, goes up with a putback, and scores for the Tigers. Koulibaly's first points of the afternoon. Auburn back out in front, 3-2 to two with nine minutes left. That breaks the 6-0 Auburn run, puts Kennesaw within three. 
Cross court pass, Scott Grayson to Hughes, feeding Koulibaly, wide open layup to the glass, and Koulibaly has four. Auburn Harden checks in, Auburn basketball. Annie Hughes throws it in baseline left to White, to Scott Grayson, cutting to the basket, taking the feed, Koulibaly finishing at the rim for two, and Koulibaly has six. Auburn's got to work at the length of the floor, going to the basket to our left, lob pass, Scott Grayson to White, Hughes, Koulibaly, yes! Auburn, Isha Koulibaly putting the ball on the floor, going to work, missed the shot, got her rebound, put it back, and it's good. Falling away, Aisha Koulibaly, 10 first quarter points. She was the SEC. Wells straight away, Hughes right wing. Looks inside, goes to Wells, top of the key. Looks right, goes left, catch and shoot three. Koulibaly, knocks it down from downtown. That's Aisha Koulibaly. Auburn out in front, 30 to 17. Hughes to Koulibaly. Koulibaly, two dribbles up off the glass and good from the left block, Aisha Koulibaly. All state. And the Tigers work it to Hughes, to Koulibaly, underhand scoop and score for Aisha. Koulibaly has stripped inside. Baker taken away by Koulibaly. Koulibaly, three on three to the basket. Euro step driving and scores. Coast to coast for Aisha Koulibaly. Also get it on the right wing. They'll go to the top to Hughes. Overhead pass Wells. Quickly inside. Baseline left. Kai to Koulibaly. Spin it around. Finishing at the rim. White to Scott Grayson. Hughes back to Scott Grayson. Right wing. Lob pass. High post. Koulibaly taking it to the basket. Head fake going up. Koulibaly for the Auburn two. State got in the zone. Auburn record. Scoring drought since they took a 5-0 lead over Auburn. Tigers have trimmed the lead to one. Hughes, Koulibaly inside the touch goes, and Koulibaly gives Auburn the lead. She has four. Your worst enemy if you keep talking about him this way. Here's Bostic on the top of the key around the screen, driving to Wiggins right corner. Wide open underneath, taking the feed. Nice pass. Aisha Koulibaly finishes. Koulibaly wide open. McFadden for the tray. In and out. Offensive rebound. Koulibaly going up. Turnaround's good. Aisha with a finish. Gathers it up, driving in the lane. No look pass from two feet away. Threw it away, and Koulibaly has a steal. Driving right side of the lane, going up to score. Aisha Koulibaly will get it. Driving, swinging left wing. Bostic falling away as Scott Grayson overhead pass to Hughes. Jordan in the air. Koulibaly with a finish mid air from the left block. Best play we've seen all day. So it goes as a turnover. So three turnovers now on Belmont already. Backdoor pass goes to Koulibaly. Nice. Laying off the glass is good. Nice vision there to see the, the open cut coming to the basket. Wrap around pass to the left elbow. Driving shot high off the glass and a good finish by Koulibaly. Koulibaly with five points of Auburn seven. Honesty Scott Grayson. Skip pass. Koulibaly driving. Shot with the right hand. That's just a good strong move yeah. as well. Really quick first step there too. Seven points for Koulibaly. Turnovers on Auburn. Straight away three is off the mark to the right. Boy, the rebound went through the hands of a couple of Belmont Bruins and has picked up. Koulibaly makes Belmont pay with the uh, last two minutes on Belmont. From the left side, drive, shot up and in by Koulibaly. She's in double figures with 11. Sonia Wells brings the ball across the line, working against... Destiny Wells driving down the left side, shot up and in from tonight from uh, Koulibaly. Down Jayla Jordan. Sonia Wells will push it down the middle. She'll keep pushing. Dish inside to Koulibaly. Koulibaly has 15. I'll tell you. Tootie Jones, pass intercepted. By Koulibaly. Lay in good on the other end. She went up with her right hand on the left side again. Seven. Almost a turnover by Scott Grayson. She dishes inside. And again, they, they draw the double team, and then Chulabali is wide open, sitting under the back. Chulabali thought about it three. Instead, drives off the glass, and a blocking foul call on Conley Chen. She was trying to draw a charge. They've found a way offensively to be effective. Koulibaly 
with Auburn's third offensive rebound put back. The Tigers are back on top by two. I was going to mention uh, cool ball from the fact Oklahoma State lack of finding the ball and defending the ball in transition. Inside it goes to Koulibaly. A good look for Scott Grayson and Koulibaly with the finish. Six. So good to see her back into the lineup. Six point game, three and a half minutes to go. Koulibaly stops and pops and gets the kind bounce. No Koulibaly now with eight. No back at the point and just trying to create opportunities for Koulibaly on the inside. A really good look by Wells. Don't know how she saw Koulibaly Terrific pass. Wells finds Hughes. They go inside to Koulibaly. She scores and an and one opportunity. Set play. They work it around. Her to come up with it, and that's Talon Collins. Inside again, Koulibaly, the spin, and drops it in. Off the back of the rim, and then it fell right in for Koulibaly. A little session game as we hit the one-minute mark in the third quarter. Well, correct me if I'm wrong, though, but the first post shot, she went with her right hand, and now she came back with the left. Oh, Koulibaly. Koulibaly, California. She has eight points today, and she's turned it into a three-point game, and there's Koulibaly with the answer. Right now, there is no answer for Grayson, Koulibaly, or somebody else. It is Koulibaly. Driving through defenders, split Collins and DeLapp to score. A nice look inside to Koulibaly, but she could not finish. Fought for the offensive rebound and did finish that time four for Koulibaly. Great pass. Guarded by Knights and a nice spin move by the freshman. To the top and Koulibaly, yes sir. AC's got a great shot off the pass, she, she walked with the inbound pass. Auburn scored off the entry last time they were down there. Koulibaly a little up and under move against Bond. That is not easy to do. Bond play. Look at how much pressure Auburn's putting on the dribble and they're just spreading out to the baseline and when there's help on the defensive end they're going to kick it for the short two. Koulibaly drives against Jada Bond and scores. Koulibaly Graves had only made one three before tonight. There's a run out. Koulibaly now with a dozen points for the Tigers, who lead by nine. And it all the entire second quarter off. They're out there to start things here in the second half. Koulibaly on the dribble drive off the glass. Off balance shot. Aisha Koulibaly now with 14 points and senior from Orlando. But that's all created by, by Rhett Moore. Taking it down on baseline, drawing the defense and finding Tolbert on the weak side corner. It was important when they were out of the game. Set her up for that outside shot. North Florida on a quick 8-2 run, and that ball is just telegraphed. Stolen by Koulibaly. One on two, stumbling and finishing. Keep driving, shot is blocked. Shot is blocked by Koulibaly. Aisha in transition, all by herself. Puts it up and off the glass. My goodness. Coast to coast, Koulibaly, she's got 20. Basket and knocking down to two. I ask you in the break, the team that does what the best wins the fourth quarter. There's Koulibaly who got the drop step, got the position. Got it back in the front court. Scott Grayson left wing to Jayla Jordan. Bounce pass to Koulibaly inside. Left block around two defenders. Up off the glass is good and she was fouled. A free throw coming for Aisha. And she scored in double figures each of the last two games. A player to watch this afternoon for Charleston Southern. Auburn goes back inside. Aisha Koulibaly with a lay-in from the right-hand side. Off the mark through the right side. Scott Grayson with a rebound for Auburn. That's her second. Low pose. Koulibaly, right-hand finish off the glass. Koulibaly has eight. That extends the Auburn lead. Scott Grayson for a tray. And left it short, but an offensive rebound for Saniya Wells. Hughes. Goes inside, finds Koulibaly in the passing lane, and Koulibaly finishes off the glass. Wells to Scott Grayson, the feed baseline right. Koulibaly taking the feed from Ty White, banks it in, and she was fouled. More free throws for Aisha. Koulibaly, right hand layup, she scores. Coast to coast for the orange and blue, and Aisha Koulibaly adding to a career total 23 points. Auburn 67-21 over the bucket. Boston. 
Racing against Lee, hesitates, gives to Koulibaly. Koulibaly going to work and scores over Jordan Rogers. Aisha gets up this basketball game. A minute 20 left. Bostic dribbling, Koulibaly head fake, racing to the basket, fakes right, goes left with a left hand layup finish. Aisha with a beautiful head fake. 60 and a half, but Litterock is leading in the field goal percentage at over 400, but Auburn hasn't beat at the three point line, so we'll see how these two match up today. A little miscommunication as here comes Auburn now. Trying to get this offense going. Inside, going to work in the post. Beautiful bucket inside by Koulibaly. Auburn only down three. Again, they closed the first half on a 6-0 run. Nice defense from the Trojans. But right inside, what an even better move. Nicely. Bostic back out to Scott Grayson. Scott Grayson inside. It's 10 on 10 inside. Christian Bourne tried to stay upright and get the block, but couldn't get it to go and 13 points Litterock is three for three of their last three field goal attempts well there's an answer for Auburn as you see the excitement what a play in Honey Harris says important she keeps out of foul trouble shot clock at five and it's banked in by Koulibaly a player that you like could not get it to go down and I think Auburn will take that shot. Her Mosa off the bounce or from the outside versus posting up down low. Koulibaly getting inside the paint. Sam Ward, Christy thomas Scotty joining you as Auburn, a team that had a 19-game losing streak snapped against Alabama State, or they did snap it in their last game, and they just pick up where they left off. 7-0 Georgia Tech run. Hit their last three shots to get to within 15. <laughs> Missed everything, but the follow goes in. So by Sarah Bates to stop the breakaway. Hey, young players out there, watch. The play is never over. This should have been a sure two for Auburn. Great job by Annie Hughes to shoot the gap. Movement on the baseline. Head fake Koulibaly, the spin and the finish and the foul. And that's an example of more controlled aggression okay. from Iswak. Really smooth offensive game, and there's a smooth pass from Koulibaly who gets it back and finishes with the three. Auburn was one for four from Treyland. The bucket. Wells with the right. Hands it over to Kulabale. She goes inside, nearly travels, but will get the layup in for two to put the Tigers up by a pair. Using her dribble, fadeaway shot against Young. Great defense. Kulabale crashes the offensive board in the block, takes a dribble and puts it in for two. Wow. Aisha Kulabale giving Auburn a seven point cushion. 15 to eight as we near international flavor yes. and talent, Susan, <laughs> from Molly. Coming to the U.S. is uh, back in those days with Wendy Larry. Well, at Old Dominion had some great ones inside. They feed it. Nice pass from Bostic down low to cool up it over to Scott Grayson, who dishes it to Hughes, working that passing game well here. Koulibaly with the little step in for two. Nice footwork and a finish by Aisha Koulibaly, who leads Auburn with that matters if we don't knock down the shot. So good cut. Koulibaly goes in from the left with the basket and the harm as that one will go against Iggy Allen, a three-point opportunity for the Tigers as they try to make it rise down the middle of the lane. Kicks it over to Wells here in the post. Turn, one dribble, inside. Leaner is good for Auburn. It's gonna be Koulibaly with the deuce. And the tie only four assists today for Auburn. Inside, down low in the block. Koulibaly with another nice finish inside. She's got 17 points to go with 14 boards. Georgia Southern surprised you with, the, with their quick shooting, but you can see the philosophy of Coach Howard, but, but Auburn has to be alert to defend as quick as they can. And there's Koulibaly. She's just as comfortable shooting as she is. Home team could be in some trouble if that's the kind of pace that continues. I don't know about you, but I think I'm going to need some oxygen <laughs> here right away. Koulibaly with the finish again. She has all five points team react to your settling down and, and getting a plan offensively just like an isolation there yep. for AC. they get the hand they get it into the hands of Koulibaly who drives and scores and she has seven does Auburn come up with here with seven to shoot 
Looking for something one-on-one -on -one with Wells. No, it's Koulibaly. Tigers lead. <laughs> no fear. No fear.